Hey guys, it's Mike with Poor Zach Golf, taking your game to the next level and beyond. Today we're gonna step inside a lesson with one of our favorite young players, Isabella Fernandez. This girl just bombs it. We were getting ready for a tournament. We're gonna take you through some of her pre-shot routine and her ball striking, do a little short game and some putting. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Hey, killing it. Yeah, well, those Santa Anas always bring some, uh, some heat. Make sure you get some water here, okay? Because it is warm today. So to me, the number one priority for you when you get to your golf course this weekend, um, because it's a new golf course, because they tournament, number one priority is getting speed right, right? That's the thing that most of the time causes players trouble um, when they are changing environments, right? It's one of the things that really is different about a lot of other sports is the golf course is going to change every event the basketball course, the football field, yes, slight adjustments maybe in the, in the field and the turf quality, but it's roughly the same, okay? But our greens, this one could be really fast one day, this one could be really slow one day, so I want you to just start here by taking some longer putts, right, and trying to really get used to what the speed of these greens are. Because again, that's gonna be the number one priority for us in order to play successful this weekend, okay? So um, throw three golf balls down there, right? Just give them a roll here. You're gonna start to just kind of feel what it's like. We're going downhill, always aware. Awesome right there. Good, so here's what we're gonna do. Let's, right, let's play and set up a little game that we can play when we are at our um, tournament site. Because I know that the first day we're gonna go out there, we're just gonna do some chipping and putting, right? I think that's what mom and dad said the plan was. So, let's set up a little ladder drill for ourselves here, okay? Now, the ladder drill, we're just gonna use one golf ball each on these, but here's the goal, right? Nothing new, we're gonna go about 10 feet about 20 feet and then about 30 feet. And we're really gonna set the goal of, this, of this, this drill is to have good speed, okay? And good speed is gonna be defined by a ball that gets um, you know, within one grip length of the front edge of the hole on the longer two, and then you know, two feet, three feet from behind the hole here somewhere else, okay? So if we can get these putts all into this little box here, we're gonna be really, really good, okay? So our goal is we're gonna do one putt, two putt, three putt. Now here's the thing. Here's our scoring zone, right? We get these putts finishing in here and guess what? We probably don't have to think about them, right? But now you're going to do first one, first putt, second putt, third putt. We're going to get all those in there, okay? If you miss one, you keep going, but you got to get all three in one round. And then once we do that, then we're going to go random. We might go long first and then short and then back, okay? So let's see it. Mm, fast greens, huh? Okay, keep going. Got to finish them off, right? But you just learned a lot, okay? Learned a lot right there. Boom, that's scoring. Very nice. Last one. Not bad, not bad. Close right there, right? Nothing you're going to have to worry about in the tournament. We're going to do it again, okay? Just because that first one is out. So let's go. One, two, three. Ooh, lip out, very nice. Perfect speed. Good, good, good. Getting right up there, tap in length, last one. The pressure putt, right? Two putts to win the tournament, is that what this is? All right, let's do it. Looking good, looking good. Very, very nice. Awesome. Okay. So this is going to be something that's great for you to set up um, at your course when you get there, right? You could just do this drill once. We did it once, once in a row. Now we'll kind of, we'll change the, the order of them to try to kind of confuse you a little bit, right? So this time we're going to start with the far one. Okay. I'll move these out of the way for you. But you can set this up on an uphill, on a flat, on a downhill. Do this a couple times during the week, right? And um, you're going to be getting great, great feedback on your speed control and getting dialed in with the greens. Mm 
Hit it out there, looking good, beautiful. Because really, to be honest guys, I mean, when we're that far from the hole, Bella's draining those putts this week just because she is um, you know, winning those tournaments. Those putts are all about our speed. Hold on actually, I'd like you to come up to this one now because that one is a lot closer to that 30 footer. I'm gonna have you, I'm gonna change it up a little bit. I wanna go from that long one to that short one, right? Let's see how we do here. Not a girl. All right, big putt right here, two putts to win. Awesome, okay. This gal is a true competitor again. Today was all about putting ourselves in situations that make us feel a little bit more like the tournament, right? Those three balls down there, having that goal of, man, I'll tell you what, I was so excited to get down there all the time to put those first three down and say, man, can I get out of here in, in three shots? Awesome, right? Um, putting these up here, right? Knowing that you've got to get these in a row to move on and put it somewhere else. It gets a little tension in our body. It creates a little desire, right? More than just practicing. So those are great things because that helps us deal with when we hit the bad shot. And what do we do when we hit a bad shot? Just find it and hit it better, <laughs> right? Go ahead and, and really think that, you know, and realize that that last shot or whatever you're worried about, mom or dad kind of watching, right? The last shot that we hit that wasn't so good, none of that matters. The only thing that matters is, boom, the putt you have in front of you right here. So let's see this one. That a girl, very, very good. Um, let's go back over to the spot over there and close out with some range work. Okay, just do a couple more of those 40 yarders and a couple uh, maybe to some targets here, okay? But main, main, main priority for us when we get out there, right, have great speed on the greens. I always tell the, the junior players that, you know, there's one common thing that most people come back and say, the greens were too fast, they were faster, right? When we play tournaments, especially as we play higher level tournaments, the greens get faster and faster. So if we can just expect that and be ready for that, right, be aware of that, we're um, gonna have some success. And speaking of fast greens, check this out. Let's check in on Adam this week is out with um, Brianna Navarosa playing the Augusta National Women's Amateur. Have you heard of that? Yeah, the top 82 women amateurs in the world, okay, out there, pretty incredible. Something you could definitely play in one day. Um, Brianna and Adam are two over right now on a tough golf course. They're in 30th place out of 80, so looking pretty good. But that's really exciting to see stuff like that, especially for somebody like you who could literally be playing in that event one day in the near future. You know what I mean? You have it in you. I know you can, okay? So um, let's get that nine iron out again. Let's get a couple swings like that. Let's get loose and then we'll hit a couple of just uh, short wedges to end the day. Okay, remember what I said, okay? Whenever you were nervous, you were a little bit more nervous this morning, right? We took those big hard practice swings. We got rid of that energy, okay? That's gonna be true forever you can do that. Um, once you do that, what I'd like you to do is kind of talk us through what you're looking for and what exactly is going through your mind when you look back at that check that you guys developed for your pre-shot routine, okay? Man, so we've hit like, I mean, 15 shots today and I don't think we've missed <laughs> more than a half of one, Bella. Um, so, I, tell me, when you look back there, what are you looking for? Are you feeling something? How do you know where to go and what do you do? Like, how, tell, me, tell me that process. What's kind of going on in Bella's mind when you do that? When I bring it back, I look for a golf ball. Sweet. I line it up with something behind me, like that tree. Wow. The edge of my grip reaches that tree. Beautiful, beautiful. Really, really cool. Wow, awesome. And you're getting those checked off before every swing. I mean, that's why we're winning golf tournaments right there, okay? I'll tell you what, this has one, been one of the most impressive practice sessions I've ever seen from you with the intentions that you take through the session, right? Your awareness to everything you're doing, it's awesome. Let's get one more good one. Beautiful. All right, so I want to see now to end the day here, two shots in a row that are going to be those 40 yarders, okay? You're going to see the same process you did just there, but you're going to have a new little spot, and that's going to, again, become a nice weapon for you. Something you can kind of really depend on and know you can hit solid. 
Yeah, awesome. Go back there again, hold it for one second, and check the weight in your feet, right? Boom, there it is. Now you can just turn through, feel that? Very important on those, uh, on those easy wedge shots, okay? Your sister and I are gonna do a lot of that today. Your spot, good, that a girl, awesome. A little short on that one. There it is, perfect, awesome right there. Okay, there's one, let's see the next one. Should be working on these every practice session to make sure you know and you have the tools in your uh, golf game to get you onto these shots right here, really solid, okay? Good. Bam. Awesome. Excellent. Hey, great job today. Okay. Awesome. We're going to have a great attitude this week, right? We're going to keep checking that backswing. We're going to not let anything bother us. Okay. You're going to be out in Vegas. Have fun. Good job today. Okay. All right, guys. Thanks for stopping by. We hope you enjoyed. Click the link below for three free videos. Leave any comments or questions down below.